Hello Click Designers! So in this tutorial, I'm going to be showing you how you can utilize the object replacer feature using the AI image editor on Click Designs. So after you've logged into your account and are on your dashboard, you can either access the editor through the template section, which I'm on right now, or the My Design section. So I'm on the template section because I actually want to work on a template. So I'm going to go on the cover section, which I am on right now, and I'm going to scroll through the different templates that I can work with. So when you scroll through the templates and you find one that you want to use, simply hover over it and click on the edit icon over here, this pencil blue icon on the corner. So I'm I'm going to look for a template that I want to utilize and I will be back with the editor all opened up. All right, so I have my template and my editor open. So what I'm going to do is I actually want to replace the background of this with an image. So I'm going to remove these shapes and I'm going to replace it with an image. So to do this, simply go on the image section over here on the side of the editor. And here you actually have four different ways to have an image on your canvas. So you can either upload an image, choose from the image library, choose from the search bar, or choose from the cutouts. So I'm going to choose the search bar. I'm going to type in an image that I want, and I'm going to choose from the options that Click Designs gives me. So if you have an image that you want to use, simply click on it, and that is going to upload onto your canvas. So I'm going to do just that and then get back to you when I have my image. All right, so here's my image. So this is a photo of an open book and I actually want to replace it with a different image, a notebook preferably. So to do that, I'm going to click on the image. It is going to open up the image settings, but here there's actually a button that reads AI image editor. So you wanna click on that. That is going to open up the AI image editor where you can choose from the many different features that you can utilize to edit your image. But for this tutorial, we are going to be clicking on the object replacer feature. So click on that. And when you do, this is what you're supposed to see. So we have a brush and what you have to do is you have to select or highlight the image that you want to replace using the brush. So you can actually also adjust the brush size. So let's make it a little bit bigger. So you have to fill in the entirety of the object that you would like to replace using the brush. So I'm gonna do that using my brush. I am just going to highlight the book in its entirety because I want to replace it with something else. So there you go. So I have my book highlighted. So from here, you actually have different examples of different objects that you can choose from. So obviously these are pre-made examples that you don't have to use, but they are helpful. You can always type in your own prompt. So you can type remove the book, which is what I want for this design and put in a notebook. So I'm gonna type that in here. So I have my own prompt typed in. It says remove the book and put in a notebook. So that's what I'm going to do. So again, you can always type in your own prompt and be completely creative with it. So once you have your prompt ready and the object highlighted with a brush, go ahead and click on the button over here that reads replace objects. And of course, wait for that to generate. So as you can see, the book was completely replaced with the new object, which is a notebook. So once you're happy with that, all you have to do is click on the done button over here. And this is just going to allow you to have the image onto your canvas. All right, so now that I have my image on my canvas with the new object, at this point, you can edit the image to your liking for your template. So I'm gonna do that. I'm going to use this image as the background of my template. And then when I am done, I will get back to you when I am finished. Finished. All right, so this is my final template. I made use of the image using its new object that was replaced using the AI image editor. So that is how you make use of the object replacer feature on the Click Designs editor. So thank you so much for watching and I hope that this tutorial was helpful.